this is going to be a guitar lesson for um, Beautiful World, uh, which is um, Noel Gallagher's uh, newest piece of genius off of his um, upcoming record, um, Who Built the Moon. Um, certainly very psychedelic, um, very... If you could compare it to an um, Oasis album, you know, it'll be, you know, Standing on the, on the Shoulder of Giants 2. You know, it's a very good album, it appears to be. And it appears to be something that Noel hasn't done previously. Um, and, it sound, and it's sounding really fucking good. Um, so I want to talk you through how to play it. Now I've watched this show, um, this being played on Jules Holland. Um, and he's playing, with, playing it with a capo on the third fret. Um, I've got a capo on the fourth fret because my guitar is um, in E flat tuning um, with no capo um, for some weird unstrained, unknown reason. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to take an A sus 2 chord, which is simply index finger on the D string of the second fret and uh, middle finger on the G string just below that on the second fret. <laughs> And make sure that you mute the top low E string because that's not involved with the chord. Otherwise, it will sound quite mucky like this. And we don't want that sound, so we're going to try and avoid that with muting it with our thumb or one of our fingers. I do mean the thumb because it gives you more control over the mute rather than having to push it down. So, there's our ATAS 2 chord. The rhythm goes like this. You could effectively play um, a very common um, pattern, a bit like this. So, which is a straight um, down, down, up, up, down, up pattern. I'll show you again just to make sure that you obviously picked it up. So. Is effectively every verse in this song. Very simple I know um, and it's certainly a great one for, for beginner players who are just starting out. So the only other change that we have in the song is going to be two more chords. So we need a D minor chord which is um, ring finger on the B string of the third fret, our middle finger on the G string of the second fret and our index finger which is our first finger on the first fret of the high E string. So playing everything from the D string down, muting both the low E string and the A string. So this is the chorus, and I'll play it for you and show you in context with the lyrics. So, one, two, three. It's a beautiful dream, it's a beautiful night, it's a beautiful world. So now we're going to go to a G chord, which is, um, ideally you want to play it the way I'm playing it, but I'll show you um, an alternative way for all the players starting out. So we'll need the G string on the 3rd fret, sorry, the low E string on the 3rd fret with our middle finger, uh, our, in, uh, our ring finger on the B string of the 3rd fret, and our pinky finger on the high E string on the 3rd fret also. And that's an easier way of playing it. Um, just a 3 finger way. So in context with the chorus, so 1, 2, 3, 4. It's a beautiful dream, it's a beautiful night, it's a beautiful dream. Da -da -da. And then we're going to go back to our A sus 2 again. Da -da. Which follows on to the second verse, by which point we go back to the chorus again, because there's no real bridge section in this song, if you like. 
It's only um, an instrumental break, which happens later on in the, in the song, uh, where the French um, speech comes in. But other than that, there's just those two sections. So the first section we've covered, which was the verses, uh, which is covered by ASAS 2. Um, and then the chorus, which is just D minor, G major, and then back to our ASAS 2 again. So I hope that's helped out. Um, I haven't done a lesson in quite a while, so um, if it's not very clear, then please put in the comments section the parts that you didn't quite understand or, you know, certain pieces that I could probably run by you again. Um, but thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe and give me a big thumbs up. And, and yeah, thank you for watching and it's great, gratefully appreciate. Thank you.